welcome back again to another video and this time it is science day so basically in my part what i've done for my um competition or maybe a collaborative artwork is a uh, scout art since i wasn't put into the other uh competitions such as um or activities such as Sai Awi, which is like a singing group where you will compose different uh, with the music with different kind of instruments and a vocal or a singerist. And um, I wasn't put the fame lab since I am not good at uh, making uh, or or like talking in front yet, but I but I do anyway. Then uh, we do have the digital poster art since um, we're online and we can't be on face to face so we've been put into digital art to make um, like posters using computers or other technology. But in my part, I was placed in scrap to art. If you say scrap to art, um, it, it just basically means that you're getting material, you're getting materials out of recycled uh, objects such as water bottles, papers, and so much more. So for my design, it's all about mountain. So I, I'll be showing you the final output in the next video. So yeah. So, uh, right now, I'm going to be talking to you guys the process or the step-by-step -step procedure on how I made my scrap the art. So first, uh, I did the, uh, or I get the illustration board. It was uh, recycled since I've been, or I kept using it since my last grade. So, I still save it. Um, uh, I used that before and then the second one is blue ribbon I haven't used this but we have this here so I did that and I uh, cut it in a lengthy size a lengthy size like pahaba I don't know what pahaba uh, means in English so yeah and uh, other one is place it at the both ends of the illustration board since I use like a rectangle right now um, get cotton balls as much as you needed so I put like a desired amount of cotton balls that I've done so that it can uh, occupy the space of the illustration board then after that paint them not too much colored gray which means that I painted 
quite a bit of the cotton balls but not entirely so that it could get an, a good effect of it then mix the white paint and black paint to create gray paint just so you know because um when we bought colored paints there is no um uh, different colors that we can get that's why instead i told you how we can make a uh, gray paint so yeah then step four place the cut cotton color paper to make the background blue yes then after that place the cotton balls into the trees you made then glue them together to stick for the rest of the background paint them blue for the main design the mountain which is my idea get the content squares in the illustration board and place them in the center of the illustration board so that you know um uh in this step four i uh just uh, told you how i did them but i didn't explain it further we got this artist self-explanatory um some of them are like uh basically just have to glue them together um place the cotton balls since uh we're placed by cotton balls is in the upper part of the station board so that it, it gives effect you know um the picture uh the yeah the picture if there's like mountain there's like this river then the other part there's like clouds I made from my illustration board is um, paint the outer since you placed or placed all of the uh, square mini square parts that you've got from the illustration board you place them in the center after that you place at the center you then for the final fi finishing touches I paint them color gray so that yeah again it gives effect it gives emphasis to my design and it would uh, uh, pop out the uh, extraordinary um, design of it from my artwork and yeah that's all for my um, process and step by step the next slide will be the output final output so 